Okay, so in anime, you got so many, 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 many kinds of characters. You got all kinds of character types. So many that, you know, you got like labels and names for them, including Tusundari. And I might not be saying that right. Oh well. Tusundari's, what they are, um, basically they're a female character. Most of the time, the female characters. I've never seen any male ones. They're female characters in anime that they have feelings for someone. Usually, they have feelings for someone. And instead of, you know, being a normal person and just, you know, expressing their feelings or something, they act like a bitch. They act like this big, angry bitch towards the one that they have affection for, or they just, you know, they're a bitch. But really, deep down, though, they they have they have a soft side, they have feelings, but they just don't know how to express it, so they act like a big fucking bitch and shit, like they're on their period 24-7. Two Sundaries are fucking horrible. They are one of the things I don't like in anime, guys. Two Sundaries. Why the fuck would anybody like these annoying ass hateful bitches i mean shit you know if a girl likes somebody like if they have feelings for them they should you know express their feelings in a positive manner you know being a bitch fuck you okay all right if i knew a chick in real life and she was a bitch to me 24 7 but then you know you have those rare moments where two sundaries like oh does like a little sweet moment or whatever and then just all of a sudden abruptly becomes a bitch again and like you know fucking smacks the guy or whatever fuck that shit that that that, that shit's stupid and it ain't worth it and you know these two sundaries they get fucking physical okay most of the time all right they'll get pissed at the guy they'll chew him out you know and then they'll follow up with a punch in the face a kick in the nuts a kick in the face like, they fucking beat these guys up and shit for, like, the stupidest fucking reasons. I mean, it pisses me off. And I know I shouldn't get so pissed off about it because, you know, it's it, it's not real. It's fictional. Well, who knows? It might be real. But still, like, um, the most stupidest example I can think of, I think, was in Sword Art Online. The last time I checked, um... Asuna, I'm pretty sure she was, like, a Tucson Dairy at first, but then she just kind of, like, you know, evolved into a non-Tucson Dairy character or whatever. But I remember a scene in Sword Art Online where Kirito is like, oh, yeah, can I stay over to your place and shit? So, you know, he's sitting there at the table, and then Asuna fucking strips down to, like, her underwear and bra, and she's, like, you know, playing with her little inventory panel, like, Okay, now you take your clothes off now. And then Kitty Toe, poor Kitty Toe, is just sitting there like, whoa, 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 what the fuck? Huh, what, whoa, hey. I just said I wanted to come over to your place. I didn't mean we had to, like, fuck each other, you know. <laughs> yeah, and then Asuna, being the bitch, she is, just fucking kind of looks at him, like, makes this, like, weird face, like she's, like, trying to shit herself. She's kind of like a mm, face like that. And then she's like, you idiot! And then she, like, fucking beats him up. It's like, okay, first of all, bitch, how is this his fault? Okay, you're the stupid slut that thought he wanted to come over to your house and fuck you, okay? And if I remember correctly, I think this is like right after Kito almost died from that fucking PK or, or whatever that was disguised as a uh, clan member or whatever. So, yeah. I don't see how this is Kitty Toe's fault. He never said, let's go home and fuck. He just said, uh, hey, can I stay at your place? Now, I know usually when a guy tells a chick that, hey, can I stay at your place? That means, uh, hey, yeah, let's have sex. Yeah, okay, I, I guess that makes sense. But still, I mean, the relationship wasn't even that deep at that point or something. Fuck, I don't even know, okay? Maybe it was. I can't remember. I, I hate it sort of online, guys. But yeah, she fucking, like, kicked him or punched him just because he... Fucking was like, uh, hey, I don't, I don't want to have sex, okay? Yeah, I mean, what the fuck? So yeah, uh, fuck you, okay? But yeah, it just pisses me off how these two Sundaries get like bitch over the stupidest shit. And you gotta feel so, so sorry for these poor male protagonists that that that, that have to deal with this shit. And I don't know why they would, okay? If I had a two Sundary bitch. 
fucking like screwing around with me, I'd be like, listen here, you listen here, you fucking bitch. Okay, this shit's gotta stop. All right, all right, just, just no. Okay, this shit's gotta stop. All right, sit the fuck down. All right, all right, get on your knees. <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, I mean seriously, it, it's fucking, it's annoying how they always bitch, 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 and then. Then they gotta, like, fucking punch him, or, like... I mean, whatever happened to violence isn't the answer. Shit. And what pisses me off is, like, most of these male characters, when they get too sun and they get, like, punched around and insulted, they don't do fucking shit. They just take it. I mean, goddamn. It's like... They don't even, like... You know, maybe every once in a while they'll say something, but other than that, they just kind of don't fucking, like, do anything about it. And that that's what... Also pisses me off. I mean, it's bad enough we got this two Sundary bitch just fucking being a cunt towards the male character. But not only that, the male character's not doing fucking jack shit. He's just sitting there like, oh, yep, yep, okay, yep, I'm getting my ass kicked, yep, yep, you're yelling in my face again for no fucking reason, yeah, 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 oh, you just hit me in the fucking nuts, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, I mean, fuck that shit, man. And then you got some two Sundarius that are just fucking, like, literally that just have mental problems, I guess. Like Asuka from Neon Genesis. Uh, yeah, pretty two Sundari. I mean, she was just a bitch, okay? You know, whether or not you like Asuka, you gotta admit, she was a bitch. Especially towards Shinji, um, towards Rei. And then she had her fucking mental breakdown like every other character, so her two Sundariness just kind of evolved into, like, fucked up shit. Now, if you ask me, guys, Yandere, which is the complete opposite of Tusundere, instead of showing, you know, physical and aggressive signs towards someone, you know, chewing them out and punching them and shit, Yandere's are where they love the person so much, if someone were to get in he or she's way, then um, they'll fucking kill them. I mean, and I know everyone right now is thinking of you know. You know from Future Diary, okay, that that bitch is pretty crazy. I mean, she'll fucking kill anyone that, that gets in her way between her relationship. Now, the thing is, I would much rather have a Yandere than a Tusundere. A Yandere loves you so much, they'll fucking protect you and kill people and shit. Now, that is kind of fucked up because it can go too far. It usually does go too far. But at least they're showing you affection by being like, I love you so much, I will fucking murder this puppy, I will murder your father. I mean, shit. At least it's not, bitch, 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 ah, you're such an idiot, god, you're fucking stupid, uh, kicking, getting yourself kicked in the nuts and shit, fuck. I'd much rather have a Yandere than a Tusundere, fuck. At least a Yandere is like, showing affection to a whole nother level. Tucendary is just being a bitch and a cunt, okay? Like, seriously, guys. Tucendaries can just go fuck themselves. And I don't know why everybody, you know, some people have Tucendary fetishes, or they think Tucendary characters are hot, or oh, I wish I knew a Tucendary so I could let out her soft side, and then yeah, we could recuperate. No, fuck that shit. It ain't worth it. Tucendaries, in my opinion, are the worst anime character type, okay? They, they, they just suck. And they're nothing but nasty, mean bitches that need to learn, hey, if you like someone or something, you should kind of express your feelings in a more positive manner instead of being a complete bitch. So yeah, that was just a little random rant for you guys. Uh, yeah, tell me what you think about two Sundaries, whether or not you like them. So uh, yeah, this is me, and uh, I'm signing out.